this is like the heat wave run back. This is the heat wave run back. This, to my knowledge, is the first set that these two have played since Sego beat Cake at Heat Wave 5. Yeah, I don't think there's really and... been any other tournament since then that they've both been at. No. Uh, Cake wasn't at One Day War. And uh, Genesis is not for another week? Yep. Two weeks. And the downside, though, for Sego is that he's not on winners this he's, time around. He, he is has not on less winners for this side. And he's got all the pressure on him. Like, we, yeah. uh, Cake Assault after losing was like, okay, I, I almost got the clean, I almost got the clean sweep except for this one, uh, this one bracket. Please don't kill. He that was lives? like the pixel. Sego! Hello? What are you doing? Being a mad lad. Oh, oh my god! No! Ah! The no! platform pulled Sego away from being able to get the confirm off of the up strong. Oh no. That was terrible. I hate it here. Okay, back to what I was saying. Cake Assault, like, immediately after losing to Sego was like, okay, I almost got the clean sweep through RCS, but yep. there was, like, one patch where they accidentally had a game-breaking bug on Olympia. Yep. And... Okay. Cake Assault's out to prove that it was a fluke, essentially. Cake is definitely out to prove that it was a fluke, and I think Sego, more importantly, is out here to prove that that result was not a fluke. That he beat Cake fair and square, and that he can do it right now. Yeah. I'm not I'm... seeing it. In game one, it's been very difficult for Sego. Cake is just kind of living right now. And there we go. when you're playing against, yeah, finally gets that kill. But you're too, you're a stock down, and. Offstage. Yeah. Spike. That's kind of what has made Cake Assault such a strong player is that snowball potential. If you lose that stock lead, he's just going to fish. He's just going to mix up his defensive options so well, and you're going to get hit by a down strong, and you're going to die. Like, yep. right here. Oh, good DI out on the clone pop. Yeah, there's Jeez. that down strong. It just covers so much space on the ground there. It really does. It's just such a scary thing to be comboing Cake Assault, just desperately trying to 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 make back a stock deficit, and he just kind of like mixes up. He just mixes you up. Yep. And then you die. All right, going to, um, I forget what the alt, oh, it's Aramanda, but Creatures of Ether. Diamond this something, is... I can't remember exactly. I don't remember. It's the Creatures stage. Yeah. Based off of the Diamond rankings image. Yeah. It's, yeah, I think this is, um. I do kind of miss that game. I don't know else since I played it. It's, it was, it was, it's a very fun game. It was Triple Triad. Yeah. Oh no. Oof. Yeah, that extension is like very hard to get around. I mean, Cake's also just hard to get around, period. Let's be honest here. Cake is very difficult to get around, and he kind of gets around you. Yep. Good read on the parry there. We love to see it. The natural it's mix up so, of the like, move. It's so rare to like see anyone actually parry punishing um, Cake Assault. It's just like, it's always great to see Ooh. that like, yeah, I know when you're gonna panic parry. Up. 
Crouch canceling the up cape yeah. in order to stay safe, but unfortunately getting popped up into the down strongs. Yeah, oh, unfortunately, you're still, you're still Forsburn, and you can still just kind of get a reversal out of a whole lot of situations. Yeah. This is, uh... Getting close. I mean, Sego does not want to let this... Close. We need... No, he, he definitely wants to make this... He wants this game. He needs this game. If he doesn't get this game, he is... In trouble. Because you got to make some sort of statement. in a lot of trouble. Here. Problem is, Kick Assault's not making it easy. Oh, there we go. Got him in the crystal, but not going to get the follow-up. How did he <gasps> live there? Like, I want to do a... I, I want to do an... Like, do an analysis. <gasps> Please don't. Oh my die. Oh, no, no. Ah! Still alive. Barely oh <laughs> avoiding God, all of these throwing out hit boxes. No. No. Oh! Hank, why did you just go straight into the upstroke? Oh my God. Just that little window of opening between the cape and the down strong was just that enough was... time for a parry. That was so scary. Oh hmm. my god. Not exactly the statement Sega was so for, I imagine, but hey, you take those. No, but he took a game. <laughs> that's the and important that's, thing. And that's... It is the important thing. Sometimes that's all you need. All that matters is the scoreboard, baby. That sure does. Look, if you're able to take a game, that's... That means you can take a set. That's always what I like to say. Is and like if you're taking stocks, you could be taking games, and if you're taking games, you could be taking sets. Like, I feel like yeah. people. Uh, I I feel like people misunderstand just how far a skill gap can be yep. between like you and a you and like a slightly better player. Mm -hmm. If you're making it like, if you're even making it even in in like in stocks. You're doing mm. pretty. You're doing pretty good. True. That being said, I have never taken a stock off of Cake Assault, so <laughs> I think we've played in bracket once, and like I missed a DJC fair to get my one stock. Yeah, I'd have to uh, go back to Frostbite Vods because I think that's the last time I ran into either Cake or Penguin. Yeah. Speaking it's been a while. Which. Sego's in the lead for this game right now. If everything goes Whoop. well, yep, Cake definitely is, in the lead now. Sego is in the lead. This is not even close to a deficit that Cake cannot make back. Oh, Ooh, too like much end lag on the Especially if Sego has these. Yeah, unfortunately, he's letting that move rip a little bit too late there. Yeah. And here comes the damage. Yeah, this oh is gosh. looking rough. This smoke is just so scary. Yep, and now with the uh, combust. Yeah, and now with combust, you are just kind of dead. Cake Assault taking that lead back. Oof, my goodness. I mean, it's like... Sego had all the cards in place, it was just... That one little indeed. mistake down below, yeah, yeah. and and, that and Cake just, was able to run with it. Yeah, that's a scary thing. You give Cake an inch, and he just goes he, a mile. He, he with makes it. a mile. He wins a tournament. <laughs> All right, going to Neo Jules Vale. This is Sego's tournament game. We are definitely like he's definitely not out of the realm of possibility, but this is a huge mountain to climb. Yeah, I mean, at least doing a good job right here off the start. Getting this damage racked up on Cake here and keeping the Sedge Guard going for a surprisingly long time. And Ooh, there it is. That. This is a huge lead to start off with. This is what you'd love to see if you're Sego. Very much so. This is kind of what we saw in the Heat Wave set where, like, Sega would just get these explosive combos for stock and run with the lead. And, like, that's, that's part of the reason why he was able to take that set. 
here we go. Another opportunity. Yes. The Nair not gonna yeah. connect. Nice conversion there from Cake's Holt. And again, okay. the no-fly zone of that cape just coming out. Yeah, if you kind of just cannot be... You kind of just can't be above Forsburn when he has that cape out. Forsburn is, a, is one of those characters that you kind of just can't be above. It's like Absa yeah. and then Hodan. And... There's a lot of characters, actually. You don't really want to be above a whole lot of characters. Just stay on the ground. It, it's where the nice things are. That being said, funny jump. Oh, no. Here we go. Here's an opening. Oh, that not opening did not quite kill... Oh, there you go. <gasps> You're kidding Ooh, me! The, the crystal. That's twice now this set that Sego's been gypped out of being able to get the kill off of that up strong. Sucks. And yeah, this is such a huge mountain to climb right now. With smoke out and with the stock lead, Cake is just been able to run away with it. Rack up that percent. Fifty-one on sixty-four. Ooh. Yeah, you and can tell that Sego's carrying a lot more. Just the amount of mental damage oh that had to have done. There we go. Oh my god. That that just completely saved Sego. Yep. This yeah, might be the momentum he needs. Yeah, absolutely have to capitalize on this. Not get hit by another back here. Oh, God. Rough stage is going to be fine, but, I mean, this window's starting to run out. <gasps> yeah. You're... You really need something. Okay. Okay, there we go. No! <laughs> nice wait there. Gets the roll. <laughs> the jab to call out the run pass. The oh IN is going to kill right there. No. Oh, oh Cake Sego. Assault just yeah. fighting with his life. Takes the Kingpin 10. Yeah, I mean, good on Cake Ooh. Assault for being able to keep his cool there because he was definitely getting into kill percent. And well, Momentum was starting to build up for Sego there, but it's oh, just... Oh, 100%. Like... Problem was, the percentage was there. All it would take is one mistake on Sego at that point. And we yeah. saw right there. Cake just, as a player, is so so good at taking advantage of, like, of those defensive options. Like, okay, I'm going to mix up my tech option ten times in a row, and you have to guess <laughs> ev right every single time or else you get down strong. Basically. It's like, it's such a scary thing to have to deal with when you have that stock deficit that, like, even getting so close